to identify the train, it will all come down to what has been the direction of the train for the last three months. Okay. Exactly. If in the last three months, the crypto market has been dropping on that coin specifically, it means that it's on a bearish market, right? Right. Or it's on a downtrend. Downtrend, yeah. Yeah. If it has been going up, it means okay. that it's on an uptrend. And then if it has been on consolidation, it means that it's on a sideways. What we are looking to launch grid bots is uptrend and sideways. Okay. So how do you identify that? We go three months from market price. So it could be something, we, no, then May 7th. May 7th, around. yeah. So around. can you put a vertical line on May 7th? It's a vertical, it needs to be the vertical. Yeah. May... Like that. Right there. Mm -hmm. So then it will be a matter of connecting dots. So as you can see here, it has touched once, twice, and three times. One, two, and three times. So it was on a downtrend because it touches three times. When it touches three times, it's how you identify the trend. Okay. And use again the trend line to draw this one more time. So you have one touch here, you have two touches here. And also, can you move this one to the left? So click here to move it. Yep. Yes. So you have one touch. Two and, when and you three say touch, What does that mean? It means it went up and down during that period. Was it a quick spike and then a quick drop? Is that what you say? Yeah, this is called patterns. And the name of these lines, well, this one is called resistance. Mm -hmm. And this one is called support. This is a little bit more of te a technical analysis. But you know, it comes very handy to know the basics of technical analysis before launching a bot because it will help you identify the trend. So here, this is a downtrend. So we don't want to launch a bot on a downtrend. Just to make things clear, we don't want to launch a bot on a downtrend. Mm -hmm. Now, we can make the same thing on the bear, on any market, like on the sideways and on the uptrend. So if you delete these two lines for now, and you zoom in a little bit more, make this a little bit higher as well. Which part? So oh. click here, okay, yep, got it. like that. And then click on the chart and adjust the, adjust the layout. Yep. And let's use the trend line one more time. You can also, no, it's down here. You can also give it like the favorite, so you will have it here. Okay. Yeah, so we identified this as the downtrend. Now, if you take a look at more of the current market price, you can see that this is clearly sideways. Okay. Right. Is there a time frame that you want to determine that it's sideways so you can just judge it based on the movement? It's going to be judged based on the pattern. So like you will use trend lines a lot to identify the current price trend. Mm -hmm. And if you draw two lines, one here and one here, you'll see it touches once, twice, and well, technically at three times. So one, two, three times. Again, one, two, and three times. So there are those three touches. So you can identify and you can confirm that this is a sideways movement. Therefore, you will be launching the bot on this market because it's on a sideways. If you were to be on this market trend and you couldn't have launched the bot because you already see that it's on a downtrend, right? Yeah. So yeah, Tulio, in, in a few words, and just to make things easy, identify the trend before launching the bot, make sure that it's on a sideways or it's on an uptrend. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. Also take these things, once you identify the trend and you make sure that it's either sideways or uptrend, you will go by the confirmations can be the CB, which are the CBA indicator, ATRB, and the RSI. We combine all of this package together and you pretty much have guarantee results. Uh, in, this using the coin, in this particular case, the CBA is not on, right? On, on when it's on the uptrend, is that correct? Yeah, it's not on. And also take a look at the RSI, it's 56. It's way too up, too risky. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, so is that clear? Are we good with that? Yeah, that makes sense. Awesome. Yeah, happy to know that. Also, there is a video that I posted yesterday. It's about the trend and make sure to go over it. It's about two minutes. It's very fast.